Hi guys, welcome back to the channel for episode 10 of the Road to 3000 I Rated. Now, after losing so much iRating due to the technical issues I had just after the rain update on iRacing, we could only ever strive to get those points back, which was 1700. So, as it's week 13 on iRacing, which is the last week before we get a new season, there's not many races going and I thought, what better thing to do than stick with a car I know on a track that's reasonably easy, which is the Mazda MX-5s at Lime Rock. Going into qualifying just before the race, I didn't bother setting a lap time, I thought. Start at the back, which is P19, and do my best to avoid all the carnage that's going to happen in front. Now, let's jump into the session and see what I rating points we can salvage back from this race. Now, if you are enjoying the channel, guys, please drop us a like and subscribe, as, you know, I do appreciate it. And enjoy! Right then, guys, so here we are for week 13 at Lime Rock. Let's go. Got to stay out of trouble. Car right. Clear on the right. Car on your left. Clear on the left. Just keep picking them off. So far, so good. We're up to 13th. The fuel will go off up this hill. I'm surprised by that. Keep it going, Nico's behind us. Gonna give him it, because he's gonna send this. Still there, hold your line. Clear. You got a slow car on the left. Go right, go right. Scrap it. Go right. Oh, I did well to avoid him. Now 11th, so can't really grumble at this start. You got a slow car on the left. Cast off on the right. Go left. It's another one off. Some decent drive coming out of that dude's a leg. Did herself over there by outbreaking herself. We're eleventh. Still seven minutes to go. Actions happening in front of us, we've got to buy this time. And there we have it. You back of trouble. Back past our mate, a leg.
So we're up to 8th. So we've picked up 11 positions. Might as well let him go. Because he's probably going to end up taking us out at this rate. Keep in this top ten. Legs sliding all over the place in front. Slight lift up that hill because it can get a bit sketchy. Five minutes to go. Keeping the pressure on. And another. We're oh, six. come on, Pen. Keep it our good old friend Oleg. Pretty sure Dylan's gonna get us at some point. Just gotta keep the pace going. Picked up 13 positions. If Dylan needs it that bad, he can have it. Take it. I'll take seventh. Two minutes forty to go. Igor on lane are closing in behind us. Should get some nice draft behind Dylan. Getting close with this group now, there's four of us battling. I 
think he's gonna have me. Yeah, he's gonna have me. Right, lanes behind us, just got to keep with these three. Bit of a boo-boo there, quite messy. One more lap to go. Now, I don't mind if people are quicker than me, as long as I can finish. And I'll take ninth, especially where we started. Nineteenth, so picked up ten places. There we have it. Coming up to the checkered flag. Eighth position. So, picked up on ninth position. I think Race Labs is. Can't really catch up to high racing. But yeah, let's pull over and check out the results. Right then, guys, so here we have the results after week 13 in the Mazda Cup. There was 12 splits in this one, and we was in the fourth highest. And we didn't have a bad result to be, to be fair, starting 19th on the grid and we moved up 10 positions to 9th, so not all bad. As average lap time were a 1 minute 8 and as best lap time were a 57.9, so all in all, looking at the stats, we was about 6 tenths slower than Jason McLean in first. Now our safety rating has gone up 0 0.05 and as I rating has gone up plus 17, so... We're slowly but surely getting there back to where we was, which was 1700. But yeah, that's it. We uh, strive to go on and um, we'll see you in the next episode, which is episode 11. So thanks for watching, guys. Please drop us a like and subscribe if you enjoyed watching.